T is reporting fewer students in quarantine today. Again, almost 2,000 are in isolation. And 10 News reporter Cole Sullivan has the story of one sophomore's experience. I woke up and I couldn't taste my morning coffee. So I, and then soon after a lot of the other symptoms came on and by Wednesday I was completely in it. And for Trent Dickerson, completely in it meant completely out of his apartment at UT's Laurel Hall. At that point, I was not looking forward to a move, but um, that's what had to happen. A day after testing positive, UT told them to go to this Holiday Inn on Paper Mill. What did you grab to take with you? I have about two weeks worth of clothes. I've got snacks, um, a case of water. For nearly a week, these four walls have been the Morristown East grad's entire world. I've got my two beds here, and then I've got a TV on this wall. He only leaves to pick up UT-delivered meals twice a day. Without taste or smell, um, I can't really give you a good um, critique of the food. But He's feeling back up to about 80% now, but contact tracers say he must stay in isolation for another week. In West Knoxville, I'm Cole Sullivan.